Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another diecast review here on the channel. Uh, I've got a pretty cool thing I'm going to start doing uh, probably about at least once a week, uh, maybe twice a week, um, depending on when I get the cars and when I can get them uploaded. But um, we're going to start out with uh, Jimmy Johnson's 2002 uh, Lowe's Chevrolet Monte Carlo uh, 164 scale hood open uh, action racing. Uh, the the some of the best 164 scales that we ever got uh, in my opinion but um we're gonna go ahead and take a look at the box you got Lowe's home improvement up there uh, and then you got Lo Jimmy Johnson number 48 Lowe's 2002 Monte Carlo one th one of 13,608 uh, you got the action 10th anniversary logo right there along with some other details uh, you got Jimmy Johnson's name right there with the signature and number 48. Uh, then obviously you got the car right there with a the little uh, race card in the back right there. We'll go ahead and flip this thing around. Uh, there's a better view of the card, uh, so that's pretty nice. And then you got some uh, the uh, the trademarks and stuff like that, the licensing. Uh, and then you got some uh, Lowe's logo up there and uh, Jimmy Johnson's name once again. So we're gonna go ahead and open this thing up. Um, this thing's pretty old. Uh, the box is kind of faded, but um, I'm sure that just comes with age. We're gonna go ahead and uh, get out of these little things. Now, I think this is a detachable body, so I'm not sure. Um, I think it is. Yeah, see, I, I, I did this in the Newman car. Uh, I'm not really a fan of these. They don't really tell you when they are. I guess they're just an added feature. But, um, you know, not bad. Honestly, it's it's kind of cool. Uh, you don't definitely don't see those nowadays. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and focus on the die cast. You got Lowe's there on the hood. Uh, the hood does open. You got the Monte Carlo nose right there with some extremely good grill detail down there. Um, just a beautiful paint scheme, a classic low scheme. Uh, this was actually the car that he threw back to uh, last season, and uh, or 2018 actually, because that was Lowe's final season with him. Uh, but you got the, a ton of contingencies right there. You got the yellow rim uh, outline thing going on. Uh, you got some side skirt detailing down there. Uh, you got the Winston Cup contingency and a bunch of other contingencies down there. You got the 48, uh, and then you got Top Choice Lumber Products down there, Lowe's, American Tradition, um, and uh, just some other sponsors right there on the post. So uh, it's a pretty nice car. I really love the detail on these old 164s, such as this one. Um, compared to nowadays, it's, it's crazy. But there we have the Jimmy Johnson rookie stripes. Uh, had a heck of a rookie season. I think he won two races, maybe three. I know he won at Fontana and uh, at Dover, I'm pretty sure, uh, but I'm not sure about anywhere else. Uh, if he did, I'll look it up, but feel free to let me know in the comments below. Uh, but you got American Tradition right there again. Lowe's, you got the 48, and uh, and then you got some side skirt detailing down there as well. It's always nice to see the little details on the 164, such as these on the window. That little, uh, I, don't, I, don't know, I don't know what they're called, but you know, just little details. You know what I'm talking about. Uh, but we're gonna go ahead and uh, take this thing off of the body um this one stays on pretty good actually my newman one didn't but if you're wondering what the inside chassis of a 164 scale look like in these uh they had tons of good detailing man i mean it's 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 insane uh there's the engine and uh the radiator and stuff like that and then you got the black dash with uh you can see in there you got the black dash with the little tachometers uh, the steering wheel and stuff. You got the padding for the for the roll cage uh, by the driver. Uh, you got the hose and stuff. And then you got the fuel cell back here. Um, just absolutely beautiful detailing. I'm, I wasn't happy with my new one when I got, but this Jimmy one's actually fairly nice, um, to be honest. So, uh, I don't know. It's kind of a little bit of a added detail, definitely for sure. An added uh, goodie, you could say. But uh, I'll try to leave the hood open while I put it back on the body if I can with one hand. There we go. Oh, no, never mind. You already seen the hood or the root, the uh, engine, I mean. So, uh, but yeah, not much else to say about this car. Um, I know this probably won't get many views because this car, I mean, everybody knows this paint scheme. But if it did and you watched and you enjoyed, please uh, reach up there and smash that like button and subscribe. And let me know that you really enjoyed this video. And uh, comment down below uh, your favorite Jimmy Johnson paint scheme. And uh, I'll, I'll be sure to respond to those and, and like them. But uh, that's going to do it for this video. Thank you all for watching. Y'all have a great day. And I'll see you all in the next one.